welcome back to another Minecraft tutorial. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to make a very simple anvil dispenser. It's, well, not really used for much other than replacing anvils, but it's quite useful in survival if you don't want to make a new anvil every time, and instead want to waste a bunch of iron on making, like, four anvils at once. But other than that one fly, it's, uh, it's pretty cool, and, well, I don't know, it's just kind of a gizmo I like to put in my house. But as you can see, once the anvil breaks, it will be automatically detected and it will drop a new one in its place. You don't want to make the tower too tall though, because it will break the anvils. So you're going to start off by placing your anvil wherever you want, and then an observer behind it, and a sticky piston one below and behind it. Then you're going to place a block on top and a block like that, and then a repeater going into that second block on one tick. Now on the second block, you also want to put a redstone torch with a block next to that and a block on top. Then you just want to place some redstone dust on top with a regular piston right next to it, like so. And that's the contraption already made. But of course you have to fill it in with your other anvils. And then I like to go down here and place another block just to make it look nicer. So, I mean, that's pretty much it already. Let's just test it out. And as you can see, it works perfectly fine. So as you, as you once again saw there, if the anvil falls too far, I think it's like four or five blocks, then it will break or it will get damaged. But if it falls from like a really, I don't know, height limit or something, like if you have a stack of anvils that goes like 20 tall, then the anvil might break. As always, that's going to be it for today's video. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.